Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jack here, and today I'm going to show you guys the best locations for catching Guthixian butterflies. And if you're unaware of what Guthixian butterflies are, they're part of an annual event that appears at the beginning of spring in RuneScape for about two or three weeks. They're great to do as a daily routine because they award you experiencing your lowest skill 20 times a day for each one you catch. And of course, this experience increases the higher your lowest skill level is. And uh, the main tip to keep in mind is when trying to find a large group of butterflies is to look for places around RuneScape that are secluded and have large numbers of buildings and, and obstacles. This is important since the butterflies seem to have a tendency to roam and usually get stuck within small spaces, so you kind of want to uh, think about that. Now that that's tips out of the way, I'm going to show you guys the best places to go, so let's get started. Okay guys, so for our first location, I always go to Faldor. So hop into your te uh, teleport tab and go to the Faldor Lodestone. And when you finally get there, you'll notice that there's actually a ton of them around the trees over here by the Heist minigame. So what you want to do is you want to run west, and you should see about five or six or so butterflies. So that's really an easy way to get a bunch of them really quickly. And if that doesn't work for you, and there's uh, already a lot of them being taken by players, you can always run into the castle area over here by Faldor. So let me show you real quick. As you can already see, there's about two or three that are already here, but the farther you get into the courtyard, you'll see that they start to get grouped up more and it's an easy way to get about 10 or so more butterflies. As you can see, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Some of them even tend to get in the castle, but this is a fantastic place, and this is usually where I farm my butterflies. And also, if you do happen to get caught with no butterflies or someone does uh, start to uh, crash you, you can always hop to different worlds. Uh, uh, world number 2 is a great place because a lot of people are at the GE, and they're usually not in Faldor. So now that uh, is so now that we're done with Faldor, let's hop to the next location. Okay, guys. So I just used the lodestone and teleported the Draenor. So what you want to do is go directly south, and you should start to see a bunch over here by the uh, the uh, teleport to the fairy ring. There's about two or three over here in the fairy ring. Uh, there's also a bunch in these little grouped up areas. So if I go over by the emissary, there should be a couple over here. There's if they're not here, you can always go into the gardening area where the stalls are. And there could, there's usually a couple. So there's one over there. There's another one over here. Uh, one more over here. So there's a couple over here. It's not the best location, but if you can't go to Faldor for whatever reason, maybe you're a skiller and you don't want to get attacked by guards or something, or you're just a low level, or you're just too lazy, uh, Draenor is definitely your next best bet. So let's hop to the third and final location. This one is kind of like a last resort, but it is a pretty decent place to find Guthixian butterflies. So uh, be right back. Okay guys, so I just teleported to Alcahard, and it, this is a fantastic place if you're a skiller and you don't want to uh, spend the time running to villages. Uh, there's already about five grouped up over here, right by the lodestone. So it's another fantastic place to go for Guthixian butterflies, especially if you're a noob or too lazy to travel, or if you're stuck in the desert for whatever reason. So there's already, there's an absolute ton over here. There's one over here, two over here, three, um, I think four actually, five. So, yeah, another fantastic place to go, and uh, once again, I would highly recommend it. I would almost make it mandatory that you go and catch these butterflies daily at reset. It doesn't really have to be at reset, but the sooner the better, so you don't forget about it. Um, they give you an absolute ton of experience, and you'll definitely go up a ton of levels, especially if you have lower levels like I do in farming and thieving and stuff like that. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Just a really quick guide, uh, once again... Please go do it. I would highly recommend it. You won't regret it. And uh, that's it. Uh, also, these aren't the best places. I'm sure there's other places you could go, but this is, these are where I go um, to catch my Guthixian butterflies. And once again, remember that these do come back every year, but they only last for about two or three weeks. So I would definitely highly recommend getting on right now because it, the event has started and doing them. So that's it, guys. I'll see you later. Peace. Bye.